<clears throat> what's up guys I got another uh, a topic for a video here so and I'm, I'm looking at this Jeep right here and uh, so I'm in the market for a, a new car I've had the mini for about it's gonna be nine years in October and I, I, it's about time for for like an upgrade where am I going here and a Jeep is one of the ones I'm looking at I already have uh, not, I don't want to say a deposit or anything like that down uh, like a, like a reservation you know uh, um, I guess to hold my, my uh, name in, in line with the Fisker um, that's another car that uh, I'm thinking about and another one is the uh, Alfa Romeo um, Tonali. That's going to come out in January. Oh, it's green. Those are the, the three main ones that I'm thinking about. Man, it's like something burning. I hope that's not me. Something's burning. Probably going to turn off over here somewhere. So those are the three up there. There you go, there's another Jeep here. But um, I was building the Jeep and I was not prepared for the price. I didn't know that Jeeps are that expensive. After I was building out the Jeep, I think it was the uh, Sahara uh, Altitude, I think it was. And I, there's not that many options you could put on it. I think it was like three or four. It came out to be 50, oh. Yeah. yeah. I don't know, I'm telling him to go to cross, but he's saying no go. I don't know, whatever. So anyway, it was $57,000 for a Jeep Wrangler. What the fuck? I didn't know they were that expensive. I mean, the Fisker was going to be right around the same price anyway. I was looking at the, uh, um, was it the Ultra one? The 50,000 plus, I'm sure, you know, with add-ons and stuff like that. But at the same time, though, it's like, I really, I really don't want to spend that much on a car. You know? But the Jeep, you know, it has a lot of, uh, um... A lot of uh, a storage and it makes it easy for me to put this bike in there. Hell, I have a hard time putting this bike in the freaking Mini. It's a pain in the ass. I was looking at the uh, also the uh, uh, Denali. Uh, it's nice. I like it. But I'm just, I'm thinking about it, but it might have the same issue as the Mini. Because really, the Mini, it'll fit. Oh, God. It'll fit. It's just the opening of the tailgate area. It's hard to put the bike in there. It's a little bit small. And now I'm thinking might have the same issue with the Tonali with that. The uh, probably uh, um, the Fisker as well. But the Jeep, you know, it's, it's easier. I could just wheel it right in there, no problem. I'm not sure. You know, I'm, I'm looking around like January, February maybe. I might. So right around that the time area i want to see what's what's going on with the fisker you know the fisker I, a couple issues with the fisker is i don't even know where to get a service what happens if something breaks you know and then what We'll see what happens 
uh, uh, what, what I decide when uh, the time comes. What's the speed limit on this road? I have no clue. This is the one I was looking at, right? Oh God, power! This is the thing that sucks with freaking these bikes going uphill. And it's bumpy. Ooh. All right, guys. Well, that, that's what I have to say. Make a right over here. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you in our next.